we're jumping Sorry right into it. Sorry for the wait, Mr. Flores. I am ready to take you now. Take me? Take me where? Now, now. There's no need to be nervous. Nervous? No. It's just your appearance. It's a little intimidating. Intimidating? Me? But I'm your friend. My name's Manny Calavera. I'm your new travel agent. I don't want a new travel agent. I want to go home. <laughs> you can't go home, Celso. You're dead. But you're not alone. Everybody here is just as dead as you. That's why we call it the land of the dead. Are you ready for your big journey? No. What journey? The four-year journey of the soul. It is quite a big trip. And I can't lie to you, Celso. It could be very, very dangerous. Unless you were to take that money you were buried with and buy a better travel package from us. I mean, wouldn't you rather cross the land of the dead in your own sports car? Maybe try a luxury ocean cruise? Or, if you led a very good life, you may even be eligible for a ticket on the number nine itself. The number nine? That's our top-of-the-line express train. It shoots straight to the ninth underworld, the land of eternal rest, in four minutes instead of four years. But very few people qualify. Let's take a look at your records. Oh, please let mm -hmm. us qualify. Oh, no, we're not even close. <laughs> well, the bad news is the train appears to be just out of your reach, but I still got a couple of tricks up my sleeve here. Mm-hmm. Yeah, ha! Yes, that's the ticket. The Excelsior Line. Yes, she's a beauty. That compass and the handle would sure come in handy, too. Oh, you're going to have a great trip. Wish I was going. Why don't you? You could give me a lift. Yeah. Oh, I can't leave here until I've worked off a little debt to the powers that be. Community service, eh? Well, I guess there are some folks worse off than me. Oh, I'll be leaving here soon enough. No thanks to dead and no commission low life cases Why don't like you. We just yours, wait for death to leave. <laughs> hey Manny, the boss told me to tell you not to leave early tonight. He wants to talk to you about something when he gets back from his trip. Tell Don not to worry. I'm not going anywhere. Especially not with clients like that. Where do they get these guys? They don't qualify for anything good, so I can't sell anything good. <laughs> can't work off my time, and I'm stuck. Stuck selling walking sticks to a bunch of burros for eternity. I need better clients. I need a real saint. I need a lead on a rich, dead saint. Oh, hmm. I'm okay, playing now. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to my channel. <laughs> We're playing Grim Fandango. This game originally came out in 1998 and was recently remastered. Uh, now, I played this game a long time ago, because I'm ancient, and I don't remember much of it, but I saw that it was available on Xbox Game Pass, and I had to check it out for y'all, so let's go on this adventure together. It's some together. sort of special work order. To all agents from office manager Don Copel. All right, you boneheads, thank you lucky stars and get to your friggin' cars. We have a mass poisoning on our hands. Too many dead to assign specific cases, so all clients are first come, first serve. So let's see some hustle out there. All right, okay. Whatever you say, Hiffy. All right, let's, let's, let's deal with that. Here's Celso's file. That walking stick was too good for him. <laughs> All right, okay. Anyways, proceeding. Let's go this way. So this game has actually uh, aged quite nicely. Uh, now it is remastered, but it looks pretty similar to what I remember. Buenos dias. Manny, why aren't you at the poisoning? Uh, oh. Oh, yeah. Uh, any messages for me? I gotta hit the bricks. Any, any messages? Any messages for me? Besides the one about the poisoning? Yeah. I only have one other message for you, Manny. I'm not your secretary. I don't take your messages. So get it through your thick skull and stop forwarding your phone to me. All right. But that sounded more like four messages to me. Oh my gosh. In 
my heart, though. You're still my secretary. Okay, well, I gotta well, hit the bricks. I gotta go hit the bricks. Okay, you show those bricks a lesson. I will show the bricks a lesson. Okay, I gotta go to the poisoning. Where's this poisoning at? Is this where the poisoning is? Oh, that's a car. So I'm guessing I get into a car? Oh, boy. Can I run? I don't know the controls. <laughs> okay, so can I just like... Ooh, I might get hurt if I try to get one down by myself. Okay, well then how do I get one down? Let's get one down then. Oh boy. Service. Hey, who the? Oh, oh, hello. Oh, sorry, sir. I didn't expect the sales agents usually don't come over to this part of the garage. Uh, I need a car. I'm Cal. I'm yeah. Calavera. Manny Calavera. My name's Gladys. I don't get many visitors. Hey, hello, Gladys. I got a message for a Mr. Calavera. Oh, uh, your driver said. That Mr. Hurley said that he could have the rest of the day off. Domino sent my driver home? What? Yeah, wasn't that nice? Looks like, Looks I, need, like I need a need new, a new driver. driver. Yeah. Oh, I, uh, I, uh, I would agree with that. Yes, you do. Are you a driver? Are you a driver? Me? Ha, no, 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 no. I don't ride them, just wrench them. You want to be my replacement driver? You want to be my replacement driver? Me? Yeah. Oh, oh, no. Sorry, can't. Rules. Um, I need... Come on, Gladys. I need a driver. I need you to be my driver. No, I can't. I'm... I'm... I'm too big. Oh, well then can I drive? If that's the case. <laughs> The cars are just too small. Uh, you just have a self-image problem. Oh. Uh, yeah. You're not too big. The cars are just too small. Yeah, those dang compact cars. Those hey, dang cars, indeed. That gives me an idea. I could alter your car just a bit. Yes. With just a quick torch job to yeah. let out the seams. Do you that. Know? Do I that. I'm not allowed to modify the cars uh, without a work order from upstairs. I could lose my job. A work order, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't torch anything bigger than a cigarette without one of these signed by the boss himself. Hey, hey, hey. that's my line. Getting people to sign. Back in a snap. Yeah, too small. I'm not too big. Everything around here is just too small. <laughs> Alrighty. Well, now I'm gonna mosey back upstairs, I suppose. Very slowly, because I can't seem to run. These controls are very fussy as well. I've gotta get this work order signed. Yes, you do. Yes, you do, Manny. Into the elevator you go now. I sure hope cars are faster than me. All right, where's the boss? Is this the boss? Oh, this is another elevator. Oh, it's the boss's office. Okay. Hello? Can I go in there? Oh. Oh, no, this leads outside. Oh! Okay, well, where's the poisoning? I have no idea where I'm going. I'm just gonna start waltzing down the street then. Oh, nope, can't go that way. Well, that was a dumb idea. Let's go the other direction. <laughs> no, I should probably go back inside. <laughs> this game is ridiculous. I really... 
I really don't remember this game much other than my cousin owning it. That's about it. Oh. What's down here? Hello? Anybody here? It's locked. Of course it is. Well, what's down this hallway? It's the bo Oh, that's where I need to be. Okie dokie. Alright, well, I really need to get to this poisoning, but I seem to be walking very, very slowly. Big Mr. Boss Man doesn't want to be disturbed today. But I need him to sign something. If I really need the boss to sign this work order. I'll give it a shot. Mr. Copel, I've got Manny Calavera out here to see you. Didn't I say no interruptions today? Eh, sorry, Cal. Maybe tomorrow. That's too late. Oh, yeah, like you're going anywhere. Yeah, I'm going to the poisoning. Dude! Dude! What poisoning? The Code 3 gazpacho poisoning that everybody's at but you. Why do I send out memos if nobody reads them? Uh, where's the poisoning Where was again? the poisoning again? Just ask your driver for crying out loud. Okay, He'll but, know. But my driver's gone! <laughs> I, can't, I can't find my driver. Yes. Manny, do I have to explain your job to you again? Oh no! <laughs> I just don't no, know No, I just want to know where my driver is. Do you want me to have him paged? Yes! Yes. Then get Don to stop being such a cheapskate and install a paging system. You're just going to have to troll the carpool until you find a demon with a driver's license. Oh, my God. I need... I need him to sign the paperwork! <laughs> I can't. Well, I got to go hit the bricks. No, I don't. I need the if I really need boss, the boss to, sign to sign the work order. Work. I'll give it a shot. Mr. Copel, I've got Manny Calavera out here to see you. Didn't I say no interruptions today? Eh, sorry, Cal. I need to get to the poisoning. I really need that work order signed. Well, I gotta and go hit I the bricks. I don't know why I can't get the boss to sign it. Oh, I guess I'm walking. This is a 90s game, so they don't hold your hand to get you through it. You have to figure this out on your own. So ignore me while I attempt to figure out how to game. Hello, you look horrifying. Hey, what's going down, clown? Hey, back off, suit. I'm practicing. Practicing what? Ring in your neck. What does it look like? Oh, jeez Louise. Uh... Can I walk through your tent? I want to see the parade. Well, walk through someone else's tent, all right? Do I look like a turnstile to you? Some festival, huh? Yeah. Yeah, pretty busy. My carpal tunnel syndrome's really acting up. But you don't have any tendons. Yeah, well, you don't have a tongue, but that doesn't seem to shut you up now, does it? <laughs> Bang! Bang. Ah, pop another one. Lousy, bony fingers. <laughs> oh, man. Uh... Twist me up one of them, huh, fella? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Twist this, all right? Oh. Okay, rude. Uh, but you can't do a cat. Well, I, I gotta go. To go. That sound makes me want to kill somebody. You too? <laughs> I have to go. That sound makes me want to kill somebody. Lousy bony fingers. Get the balloon twister to pop a balloon. Awesome. I got an achievement. Wonder bar. Now to figure out how to kill somebody. Sorry, doink somebody. 
Maybe I'll go this way. Hello? 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 Yes, hello. Alrighty then. Now what do I do? I need that document signed. It's but huge. Yes. I can't know. open it. Oh, well fine then. Oh, what's this? Oh. Okay. This is very random. Oh. Oh, this is horrifying. Is this my window? No. It's not at all. Ooh, whose office am I in? It looks like Don's rigged his computer to automatically answer his intercom. Oh, he's not even here! say no interruptions today, whatever. It'll have to wait. Oh, cripes, Eva. Just sign it yourself. Well, yeah, I'm busy. Aha! Yes! Right, Eva, just sign it yourself, will Perfect! You? Busy. Yes! All right! There we go. Anything else? Does he have anything in here that I should be aware of? All employees of the Department of Death Bureau of Acquisitions, employees who have made their sales quarters are invited to take the Day of the Dead as a holiday, as long as they make up the time lost on the following weekend. Idiota. All right, okay. I would love to search Don's office right now, but I'm late for the poisoning. Oh yeah, that's right, the poisoning. Can I go out the front door? Do you think they'd notice? That's not the door, is it? No, no, it's very much not. Oh, let's go this way. Is this the door? If I go out that way, everyone oh. will know I was snooping around in here. Okay, so I have to, I have to climb back down. Oops. Fussy 90s controls. I would love to search Don's office right now, but I'm late for the poisoning. I know, bud. I heard ya. I heard ya. Let's go. Oh my god, I love that the birds are dead. <laughs> That's great. All right. Back to the office now. All right. Let's go get Ava to sign this document. All right. Hey, Ava. Want to sign this document for me, please? I mean, can you get the boss to sign this document Ava, I really for me? need the boss to sign this work order. I'll give it a shot. Mr. Copel, Mr. Calavera has something out here that he says he needs your signature on. Ah, oh, cripes, Ava! Just sign it yourself, will you? I'm busy! Yes! You'll have to excuse him, Manny. It's probably a really hard crossword puzzle he's got in there today. <laughs> Eva, I'm impressed. I had no idea you had this kind of power. Well, we all have our secrets. Yes! There we go. Oh, and I'm all dressed up now. Yeah! Hey! Stop I like it! This, don't I? Yeah! Yeah, well, they say black is slimming. I'm driving! Yeah! I'm driving! Oh my gosh. Por favor. I could have walked faster than this. I know uh, you couldn't, Manny. Don't lie. I saw how fast you walked. Oh. Okay. Okay. Domino. Ooh, the living still give me the creeps. Oh, we're in the land of the living? I can't use my bare hands. I'm oh. a professional. Sorry. 
It's the fear of death that makes monsters of us all. Okay. What am I gonna do? I can't reap hamburger, cows, or a whole other bureau, not to mention right. the lettuce. So I can't use my bare mm, hands, so then Smells what? like the perfect client, rich and sweet. <laughs> okay. Hi, can I use your bare hands? Okay. Boo! Boo! <laughs> Scaring the living is technically against the... I can't use my bare hands. It's... I'm a professional. Well, then what do I do? Can't use your bare hands. Scare, scare the living a few times. There we go. I can't reap hamburger, cows, or a whole other bureau, not yeah. to mention the lettuce. I, if I scare them to death, then they'll become a customer. But I can't reap hamburger, I, cows, or a whole other bureau, not okay. to mention the lettuce. Be, be quiet, Manning. I don't know what to do. Okay. Okay. Um. That. Oh, hold on. Oh, what? Okay. I didn't know what this was. Bound only by the paper-thin wrapper of mortality, a soul here lies, struggling to be free. And so it shall, thanks to a bowl of bad gazpacho and a man named Calavera. Calavera. Hold on. So then, what do I do? I can't use my bare hands. I'm a professional. Bound only, and so it shall. Thanks to a bowl of bad gazpacho and a man named Calavera. Oh! 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 Okay. That took way too nice long to bathroom. figure out. That took way too long to figure out. For several travel package upgrades if you care to cut the yap. I want something cheap where I can get some rest. Now that's it. Aye, aye, aye. Okay. You know, Manny, so you don't I want could the make this car a little faster if you wanted. Yeah, yeah. Whatever. I would oh, love yeah. Slam the front into the wheel. I weed. would love a faster Up car. The rear end. Two blowers popping out of the hood. <laughs> You'll get plenty of rest this way, Mr. Martinez, and you'll be safely padded by the foam created when these two chemicals mix like this. Oh, on second thought, I, I want to upgrade my package. Sorry, Bruno, but you didn't qualify for anything better. But here, have this complimentary mug. No, wait! <laughs> Can't you find me something where I can move my legs? You know I'd like to, Bruno, but my boss is a real hard ass. I gotta be a hard ass when I got lazy sickle waivers like this jolly boy working for me. Manny, you couldn't find a sale at a yacht club. I got a sale right here. I'm talking premium sales, Calavera. Like the kind Domino makes. How am I supposed to make premium sales with the scumbag clients you're sending me? Hey, <laughs> now you're blaming the clients? I've had it with you, Manny. If you haven't bagged a premium before the next sales report comes in, you're out. Out on the street, no job, no way to work off your time. Just your fancy suit and your big smile and a whole lot of time to kill. Oh, shit. Who are you calling a scumbag? Why, well, I ought to... <laughs> well, I guess you're living in there forever now. I'm sick of waiting around for a good lead. Like it's gonna fly in here tied to a brick? It's time to take one. I mean, maybe. Never know. Hey, you missed a great hey, poisoning. Hey, you missed a great poisoning. Yeah, and you missed a great client. Domino came back from there with a nun. Equally, I got a tiny little man with a mean temper and no commission. Well, at least you don't work for one. <laughs> you know, Copal's not really in his office. Sweetheart. I know what you're up to. Huh? You're trying to get me away from my desk so you can link all my paper clips together again. Grow up, darling. <laughs> all right. Well, I gotta go hit the bricks. Okay. Now what? Um, oh, have I been in here? No, I have not. Let's see. Oh, hello. Are you my boss? Well, at least you're not hitting the bottle anymore. Hey, Callie, how you doing? 
how'd you make out so, with the So, how'd you make out of the poisoning? Well, let's just say that Sister Calabaza has a secret passion. For trains. You got a nun? Hail Mary. And you sold her a ticket on the number nine train. Choo-choo, little buddy. <laughs> oh, great. Say, how'd you score? I got a nun, too. I got two nuns, actually. I got a midget. Midget. I got a mean midget I had to send parcel post. Ah, cheer up, buddy. Another day, another death. Am I right? Um... I want to punch you in the mouth. I want to punch you in the mouth. Oh, no. Not the Christmas party all over again. <laughs> all right, uh... Okay, well, see you in limbo. See you in limbo. Oh, that's great. We should do this more often. Yeah, yeah, we should. It's so nice having you next to my office with your fancy glass doorway and your nice paint job. And then there's me. Boring as hell. All right, now what? Can I go further down the hallway? No. No, I cannot. All righty. Let's go talk to Big Boss Man and see if he has anything for us. Big Mr. Boss Man doesn't want to be disturbed today. Oh yeah, that's right. I guess I need to talk to this guy again. Oh, uh, you know what? Maybe I'll save talking to him a little bit more next time. Uh, thank you so much for watching. If you are enjoying Grim Fandango, please leave a comment and a like on this video. And uh, if you haven't already, subscribe. If you'd like to see more of this game, please let me know. And yeah, very nostalgic for me, so I'm enjoying it. Have a magical day, and don't forget to stay geeky.